What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking by to be down here. Michael, it is Wednesday. It is hump day. We've made it this far, guys. Uh, today, I'm going to be doing back and some biceps, keeping it simple. Uh, again, if you've noticed my routines here lately, I've kind of cut things down a little bit. Uh, get in, get out, get it done. Uh, don't overwork yourself. Um, but anyway, uh, last week I did some bent barbell rows. So this week I'm just going to do some uh, pull downs. And uh, yeah, so let's get that started, guys. I got 70 pounds on the machine. And uh, let's get it started. All right, guys. Doing something a little different here. We're narrating over a standard video. Just uh, giving you a little something to talk about here. Yeah. It's good to stretch out your body before you start uh, this movement. It just opens everything up. And uh, I like to approach the pull down in such a way as I'm uh, like I would do pull ups or chin ups. And uh, some sets I approach it a little bit closer to that. Uh, sometimes I, I fall back some and sometimes I sit up some, but I try to look up and I try to act like I'm doing a pull up. Because that's basically what you're doing with these, you're kind of mimicking a pull up. But the good thing about pull downs is you can do all sorts of kind of tweaks and variations with your body and your grip and uh, whatever accessories you're using to pull with. So. Uh, Today, of course, I'm choosing the long bar, and uh, that's pretty standard. Feels good. Good little workout here, guys. So I uh, hope everybody's having a good hump day. Uh, it's definitely been a kind of week to have a hump to get over for sure. So here we're up to about 5,924 pounds. Not quite that, but probably around 180. I don't know. 140, 50, 60, 70, 80. Yeah, that's 180. So, doing pretty good there. Uh, this next two sets I'm going to strap up. Uh, as you can see there, I got my straps on. Uh, we got 200 pounds on there. And uh, I wasn't feeling like straining. I think I have done them without straps before. But just to make sure, you know, I got a good grip. And I'm holding the bar and getting working the muscle and all that good stuff, you know, we'll, we'll go for the straps. So last set of the pull downs, we still got 200 on there. As you can see, it's still, still pretty decent looking there, 200, and believe me, that machine is uh, 200. All right guys, that's all we're gonna do for back, and now we're on to bicep. So my movement of choice is something I don't do ever. Uh, we're gonna do some dumbbell hammer curls. And I guess I'm gonna do them right. Uh, they got some that come up straight. Then they have some that come across the body. But those might be spiders or something. I don't know. We're just gonna do the basic straight up and down. Got 25s. Starting out with. All right. One. One. And right here we're getting in some. Two, curls that I don't do very often, two, like I mentioned. Three, I don't really do the three, spider curls, four, or hammer curls. These are hammers. Four, I don't really do them very often five, at all. Five, uh, they're not a bad curl. They six, do hit the biceps okay. You also six, feel it in your uh, forearms a little bit. Seven, but uh, I think they do the trick eight, regardless. Eight, and, uh, nine, try to keep them fairly four, clean. Uh, of course, you're always going to move a little 10. bit. That's just the nature of the game. Your body's meant to move. I've tried to kind of push that uh, in some of my videos in the past. We're kind of like a tree, a building, a bridge. You know, our, our bodies are meant to move when stress is applied to them. You don't stand still. Of course, you don't want to flip and flop around like an idiot. But as you can tell, I'm not doing that. And I might later. Seven, Who knows? Seven, eight, eight, We're getting some pretty good nine, pump here. 
usually around seven to eight reps. Uh, I start really feeling a burn. Uh, usually, usually, no matter what kind of curl I'm doing, it's usually around the seven rep mark that I'm starting to feel. Feel the burn set in. We're really concentrating. Look at that face. I made that face earlier before I came uh, in the gym to work out. If you know what I mean. Ah, feel better. Anyway. I think I said 100 pounds. No, I didn't say 100 pounds. I wish I was 100 pounds. Going pretty good here. Pretty good little hump day workout. I was just thinking there was a time whenever I used to do two or three different movements per body part. I, I'd be worn out by the time I was done. So, as you can tell, I've, I've cut that down a lot. And uh, I'm keeping things a little bit more simple, quick, to the point. No sense in killing yourself. And uh, especially when you are El Naturel, like people like myself, you know, we're not all hopped up on different things. And uh, sometimes even not eating enough during the day. So, you need to watch what we're doing and not, not overwork it. Just get you a good workout in. Don't mean we don't press it and go for some goals and kick some butt. Look at that face. I kick butt right there. So, this is the final set of this, and uh, then we're going to close out the video with my normal closing, and uh, I hope everybody enjoys the video, gets a little something out of it. Not just the weight I'm moving, but the fact I'm in there doing it every day, kicking butt. I want y'all to kick butt too, and uh, stick around for the closing of the video, and uh, have a good day guys. See ya. Just like that, we're done with another day, our hump day. Uh, pretty good workout, simple to the point, very basic, nothing crazy. Uh, pretty happy I went up to 200 pounds on the pull down for two, two sets of five. Uh, of course, I did use the straps for those. I have done them, I think, without the straps, but I thought, eh, I'll go ahead and use the straps since, uh, you know, I'm not totally in the game. And I thought, well, make sure my grip is good and I'm on there, so... Uh, got them done. Did the uh, hammer curls, which I never do. I went up to uh, the 50s. I only know what I got. Five, six, seven reps. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, had some good sets, some good reps, uh, some good burn. Got a good pump. And uh, that's really all we need, guys. And uh, we can make ourselves a little bit stronger on the inside and out uh, by accomplishing small things like this every day in our lives. So, uh, anyway, tomorrow's Thursday and, uh, tomorrow is shoulder day and I might throw some, uh, legs in there as well, uh, with the shoulders. So, uh, be on the lookout for that. I don't know if I'll do a full video or a commentary type thing or a, just some shorts. I had no idea what I'll do. I don't usually know that until I get in there and start going. So, Anyway, guys, I hope you appreciate the video, the channel. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, if you will, uh, to the Body Beatdown. That's me, Michael. Um, going to go get my chicken all finished up. I'm making some chicken tacos. I eat a lot of taco type stuff. But I try to eat them healthy. And uh, so I've got some chicken tacos for tonight. And uh, no lettuce. I forgot to get lettuce. Dang it! Ow. Anyway, guys, get up, get out, get red, do it to it, and enjoy life. See you later. Get up, get out, get red, and do it to it.